Hold on, we have we have a Muslim. Hold on. Oh, we have a Muslim. We have a Muslim. You believe it? What is? Huh. Okay, hold on. We have a Muslim. It's hard to believe, but it's true. Hello. Hello. Mute, mute YouTube, please. Hello. Hello. Yes. Yes, you are live on air, my friend. Who is who is with me? Mute. Your daddy, ultimate proof. You keep running. How are you, ultimate proof? How are you? We keep running from you. You are scary. So, ultimate yeah. proof, what do you think about your prophet saying where I will be tomorrow? He said what? Your prophet saying, and I'm showing the story in this in the screen. He was dying, and he said to Aisha, "Where I will be tomorrow? Where do you think your prophet he will be tomorrow? And why he's asking this question?" First of all, um, this truth or not, nobody knows what they're going to be. Allah said in the Quran mm -hmm. that the prophets will be worried about themselves. This is how Islam The, the is. prophet will say what? what, what, what you what, can what? do. Sorry. The, the, uh, uh, expecting. Let me ask you No, no, no. I, I want to be sure what you are saying. The Quran says what? I did not hear you. My, my friend, we're not speaking at the same time. Please. Don't me, don't you see? You see, you this, is, this is what you do. This, no, I did, I did not get you. I did not get you. You said the Quran said what? Repeat again. The Quran said what about the prophets? The Quran said hmm. that Allah said in the Quran that hmm. He have forgiven every sin of the prophet, past okay. and coming. Which verse? Which is verse is that? But at the same time, no, no. Which verse? Which, which verse is that? No, no. Tell me same time. Hold on. Which verse is that? Question, which please. verse which verse is that and and hold on no 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 you see you are saying in the Quran which so do you, do you know or you do not know which verse is saying Allah he forgive every sin for the Prophet oh you don't know the verse I, I tell you no problem tell me okay I'm waiting oh, that's it yeah. That's all yeah no problem brother hmm. I tell you every verse okay I'm waiting are you searching no. Google I tell you, one second. You want a precise voice? You know the voice exists. <laughs> you asking some dumb Okay, are you I, searching? I, I, I will answer you. Okay, give me the verse. That's right now. Hmm. Which one? Brother, give me 10 seconds. 10 seconds? Yeah. Hmm. No problem, brother. Hmm. Uh, it's gonna be hmm. 482. Well, I'm showing it in the screen since five minutes ago, and you saw it in my screen. This is how I'm not this, sure. this, is, I'm this is this is how funny you are. Okay, right. so now ask me for the okay, verse. read the verse for me. It doesn't it doesn't say that Allah it, it doesn't say it doesn't say that Allah you know forgives. You, you see, you see. You digressing. Let me answer your question. No, you are answering now. You are answering. We are having a conversation. The verse does not say that Allah He forgave to Muhammad his sin. Why you are lying? Read the verse. Here we go. It's in front of me. It says that may Allah, may Allah forgive your sin. May Allah. He did not say I forgive your sin. Read it. He said I have forgiven you your past and uncommon where, sins. Where it says that? Where it says what, that? Where it says? Read, read it. Read it. It says may Allah, may, may Allah, may Allah forgive I, your sin. I okay. said, what translation are you reading? What translation you are reading yourself? asking you i don't know that is a translation of uh, hilali and khan muhammad hilali and muhammad khan what? yes uh, read okay. any read any translation okay just it says it says that that allah that may allah that allah may forgive your sin okay now we go back 
So that doesn't say that, but I, I will go with you. Let us say the verse saying Allah forgives sent to Muhammad. So why Muhammad asking what he will be? Why he is not sure? Because another verse says mm. uh, this is a this is this is what belief is about. Mm. And no need to be in this world mm. and be for certain of where you going because you don't know what you did. Which verse is that? People don't know. Which is verse? Only which Allah is, knows. Which Let verse? Me answer your question. Which? I, I did ten seconds. You, you're gonna start cutting me off. Yeah. That's why Muhammad Hijab will be tearing your ass up because you don't have respect to people. You see? And then you be complaining. No, I, 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 I don't. I don't. Res see? I don't respect liars like you. First no, of all, first of all, when you say you when you say a verse. When you say, when shut you up, when you say, shut up, you, you know what? Listen, be, 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 behave, behave, behave. Listen. What is the verse? Where is, where is the verse that says that Muhammad is not sure what he will be in the Quran? Yes, he said he he gonna be worried about his own neck. Where where it says that? Where where in the what verse? Show me. I'm I'm learning from you. Go ahead. Which one? Okay, no problem. Okay. Uh, whatever you ask, bro, I, I tell you. Okay, which one? I'm asking you. This is why you, you let me talk to you. I'm, you're having a conversation. I, listen, okay. I'm not ready for every question. Give so, me 10 seconds. Okay. I give you the answer. Okay, what is the verse? Simple. I can ask one million No problem. Stop wasting answer. time. Just give me Stop. the verse. What verse? I'm just telling you. I can ask you one million questions about the Bible. You will not answer right you, away. You, okay, but listen, answer. listen. You are giving me an answer. I, I want details, my friend. You say that the Quran says that Muhammad he will not oh, be yes. he will not be sure where he is. But the Quran says those who did good and those who believe they will have heaven, they will have rivers. So why if, if this is only even for Muslims, general Muslims, so why Muhammad himself is not sure? Because Muhammad is a human being, he had a mission. Hmm. To deliver a message, he did his mission. Mm. He's a human being. He sinned mm. like people. Mm. He has forgiven and no substitute. Okay. Inshallah, Rabbi. Every right. messenger of Allah, right. Inshallah, right. Allah, Inshallah, okay. Inshallah, with the will of Allah, mm. will be going to mm. heaven. Okay. We're expecting that. So you are saying, but okay. So so you are saying the Quran. You are saying the Quran. Listen, listen. Being humble. Okay. If be, you let me speak, Mr. Being humble. Yeah, Mr. Being humble. Mr. Being, being, being humble. humble. The Quran being, promise. Being humble, let me, let me talk. You let can me talk. shut up and let me finish a sentence. You... <laughs> let me speak. Let okay. me what does this have to do with being humble? What does this have to do you with see, being humble? You know, and then you compare when, 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 when hijab treat you uh, as a bastard, you have the, nothing to say. The, 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 bastard, the bastard is your prophet. He was born four years after his father's death. And I can prove it right now as we speak. So be, behave yourself. Behave uh, yourself. Behave yourself, son of Muta. I did not mention your mother. Respect my mother. Otherwise, I will insult your mother. You are a son of Muta. This is no, why you are not. You, you did. Mentioned your mother. You, 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 you right called me. You, you call. Off. You just called you, me. You, you said, called. You just called me bastard. And the fact you are the bastard because according to your prophet, according to your prophet, your you father. Mary slept with. No, I never said that. You are a liar. This is editing of videos. You are a bunch of cowards and you are liars. Okay. You are liars. Okay, you want to hear? <laughs> Shut up, you filthy coward! You are a filthy coward. This is this is editing. You, you must be filthy coward, people. You have no dignity. Editing? Do you proof? Yes, we you never proof. We we'll give you proof because the, I know what the proof. I, this is video editing. I say that from one I step with someone, you edit the video, you put it together. Filthy or filthy like your prophet. Don't change the topic now. You want the proof or not? We know the proof. We knew. We knew that you are liar. We knew. But Christians, they are here with me always, and they never heard me saying that. They knew that you are a liar like your prophet. Filthy coward. Son of Muta. You see the man Jesus slept with his mother. Filthy. Disgusting. Look, guys, the Quran says, <clears throat> you see, he changed the topic. Faithy cowards, and give a glad tiding to those who believe, and do righteous righteousness, good deeds for them will be guarding. What Muhammad being humble? The Quran promised already normal Muslims you will go to heaven. Those are normal Muslims. Anyone who believe and do righteous and good deed, he will be in heaven. He will have God in a river. So why the prophet you do not know? And this filthy, he says, we are running away from you. You are filthy. You start calling me names. Shame on you. I did not insult your mother. Verse 
very filthy people they do editing to my videos everybody knows who i stand for we fight 24 hours to get you busted just because you say jesus is not a prophet so how christian prince will say what you said you filthy coward i can show you right now that according to your quran jibril he made mary horny filthy coward this is how disgusting you are. This is why I call you the ultimate fart. And this Mimi Hijab, he start insulting, so he will not answer. I did not call Mimi Hijab a bastard, but obviously he is. You know? Yeah, he's calling again. <laughs> are you going to behave or you will call names? Yeah, hello, Christian Prince. Yes. Go ahead. Hello. Are you okay, boy? Sorry? Go ahead. Hello? There we go. Coward, they do anything to my videos. Did you say that? Filthy, disgusting. They could not debate me. They tried to frame me. They say, Christian Prince, he said that about Jesus. You filthy, disgusting. You filthy cowards. Shame on you. Shame on you, filthy people. You would have no dignity to fabricate audio. I can make now. From your conversation, I can make you saying things you never said. I just cut words, put them together. The boy is your prophet. Because if he's not, at the age of 56, he will not be thinking about a girl she is six years old. Ultimate fart. And as you see the Quran, did not say Allah he forgive the sin of Muhammad. It says may Allah forgive your sin. It's a wish. And this is a proof that the Quran is a false book. Because if Allah is talking why he say may Allah forgive your sin. Hmm? Allah saying to who may Allah forgive your sin. To himself. Allah is wishing Allah to forgive sin. And Muhammad here is being a humble man. What humble man? The guy is dying. This is in his death, you idiot. Where I will be tomorrow? <laughs> this is about being humble. This is about he's not sure. He should be saying to his wife, don't worry about me. I will be with Allah. What he was saying is the opposite. Cowards. There's one thing all the Muhammadan they share. They cannot refute you. They try to put you down as a person. They make it personal. So they do editing for videos. They make you see from from the video I made today. You can make many stories as you wish. I said the word sex, I said the word penis, I said the word... You can put them together, you make a story I never said. Cowards. Every Christian knows what a Christian prince he stands for. And every Christian believe that Jesus is the Virgin Mary. And every Christian believe that Mary is above all mankind. So how dare you to say what you are saying, you filthy coward. And right now, if there is a Muslim want to call me, I can show you where it says in your interpretation that Allah, he sent Jibreel, and Jibreel, he made, he breathed into her private part, and he made her horny, so the sperm of the man which Allah created inside her made it move and made Jesus. And now they will talk my, take my voice, and they will play with the recording, and they will say, see, he's saying something about Mary. Filthy cowards. And by the way, 
This is not only increase the support for a Christian prince because the, 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 the Christians, even those who maybe he don't care, they will see that Muslims are a fraud. Not only they are not truthful, but they are a fraud because when you fabricate audio, you are a fraud. You cannot answer me. You cannot debate me. So now what do you do? We fabricate audio. Cowards. Now, if there is any Muslim want to tell us why Muhammad, you see, I was going to go, but look like our internet is fine now. Any Muslim want to tell us why Muhammad is worried in his death where he will be? And look at the stupid answer. He is humble. What? What humble? What does it have to do with being humble? So if you say I will be in heaven, you are not you are not humble. <laughs> if a person he read the Quran and the Quran says those who do righteousness and those who believe and those who follow the prophet, etc., they will go to heaven. If you say based on this, I will go to heaven, that make you not humble. You know, my friend, he is not making point. He is breaking the fake. He is going to play the fake audio. He is not answering. He is not talking. He will start playing uh, uh, the fake audio. And don't tell me, please, what to do. If you don't like the way I do it, you can leave. I'm dealing with those people for years and years. All of them, they are the same equality. Rarely, you will find a person who is gentle, respect himself, and speak politely. And if they are not a fraud, you tell me why they fabricate audios. If they are following the good God, why somebody following the good God will say such a thing? Right? Your face in Muhammad Hijab. Muhammad Hijab, he does not know me. He put pictures of people who... And who told you I'm hiding, you idiot? I go and do seminars. It is you, Muhammad, and is hiding. And you know what your Allah is? You see, Muhammad Hijab, his last name is Burqa. And in the Middle East, they will not call your last name Burqa unless you are a coward. And by the way, even Allah himself, according to Islam, he wear hijab. If you are asking me why I don't show myself, you just say that they have a picture of me, so how I am hiding myself. <laughs> you stupid idiot. Post pictures of people. Look what the Quran said. Allah, he never speak unless he is from behind the hijab. So why you don't say Allah is coward? Here we go. It's not given to any human being. Allah should speak to him unless it be an inspiration or from behind, behind a veil. Do you see it? Do you see it? Is your God Allah is a coward? Any Muhammadan would like to call? The Prophet is humble. And Allah, he said he forgave the Prophet's sin. Where is that? And you know what? If he forgave his sin, why? He do not know where to go. And yeah, this is the guy who believed that Rashad Khalifa had the correct Quran. Rashad Khalifa, he cut the Quran pieces. He said there's a corruption in the Quran and he deleted verses. If there is any Muslim would like to call? Filthy, trashy. You know, look what they did with the apostate prophet. Do you, do you, did you see the videos they made for him? The same story. They start to, you know, they try to humiliate him, make it personal. They could not answer him. So they start saying he is having sex with his sister. He liked to have sex with his mother. I mean, very filthy, trashy people. Garbage. Can you believe it? The guy he don't be, you know he don't believe in Islam. Why you go to that level? Because simply this is their level. This is how trashy they are. Let me show you the post of uh, Mimi Hijab. Hold on. 
I think I still have it maybe. I post it in Facebook. Uh, maybe this one no this one hold on I have it in Facebook actually Mimi Hijab speaking awful words about the apostate prophet claiming that he is right now as we speak maybe he's luring his sister you believe it how trashy how garbage they are and all of this because the guy he left Islam. We know. Not because he's a bad or you, you don't even know him. The guy left Islam. So what we will do, we start fabricating lies about him. Give me a second. Let me find it. I have it in uh, Facebook. Just to show you how trashy they can go, how low. They are the same as their prophet, the same as their God. Nothing different. From their fruits, you shall know them. <clears throat> I'm going to go to my Facebook page and grab the images. And by the way, the video I made for Mimi Hijab about him uh, cutting my videos, audio, uh, reported by Mimi Hijab as hate speech. And Facebook, they send me, uh, like, we we are going to delete your video. Uh, do, you, uh, do you have any response, whatever? So I respond, this is no hate. Re watch the video, please, etc. And uh, Mimi Hijab got busted and the video is back. This is how coward they are. I don't flag, I don't even flag them speaking against me because that will bring me more people here. Make as many videos as you can. More Muslims will hear about me and they will come and they will see the truth. Let us see. <clears throat> uh, Skype is very slow. I mean, uh, Facebook. The page is taking forever to load. Yeah, uh, and anyway. Is a person, if a person, he don't believe in Islam and he left Islam. What a, why you are going to speak about his mother, about his sister? I mean, what kind of a human being you are? And supposedly, they are trying to teach us about ethic. Here we go. I found it. I found the first one. There's two of them. Let us see. Here we go. Let me put it in the screen. So everybody will see what is the level of this this this, this kind of people. Um, all right. Here we go. We found the first one. This is why, actually, they don't even deserve I talk to them. But I agreed to speak to them just to get them busted, and we did. The coward, he did not let me talk. This guy, I'm just having a conversation with him. I did not mute him. Look at this filthy Mimi Hijab. And you tell me what kind of a human being he is. Muhammad Hijab. Why would this incest endorsing Islamophobe who may be attempting attempt, attempting to sexual lure his sister as we speak can you believe it and I assure you this guy will not speak in such a language unless he himself is doing that to his sister Because I cannot imagine somebody saying that to somebody. Unless he is a person who think about that. And the coward, by the way, he deleted this tweet. 
but it was too late. People copy it and post it around. But this is telling you the level and the standard of those people. They are street boys. Trashy, garbage in, garbage out. There is other one. I don't know where I, I can find it. Uh, I will try to find it where he said something else too. Not only this. I mean, he had this guy. He said, "But it's good to copy their their uh, their garbage, so later they can get busted." Let us see. I think this one here. Okay. Uh, no, this is a different one. Anyway, the second you start attacking this cult, they will launch a war against you as a person. And they think they can intimidate you, and they think they can harass you, and they think, you know, you have no idea who I am. I'm doing this forever. I got death a threat, I got uh, people want to kill me, I got people want to pay me so I can stop uh, exposing Islam. All of this will not work. The only thing will work is that you bring me more people. Imagine how many people now in the channels of those Muhammad and they will hear about Christian Prince and they want to know what this guy is saying. And they will come to me and they will ask me, did you say that? I will say this, those are liars. You know, this is what I do all day long, defending the truth. Christ is my Lord. Every Christian, he knew that. I will never say that. They are a bunch of liars. They have no dignity. They have no honor. The same as their prophet. And by the way, according to Islam, you can have your sex with your sister in heaven. Actually, hold on. As long as we are mentioning this topic, I hope I will not lose my internet. Give me a second. I will try to find a video about this topic uh, <clears throat> let us see here we go I think this is the video maybe let us see. <clears throat> uh, no, not this one. Maybe, hold on. Let's see. Maybe like uh, at the... we need to hear a little bit so we can see. <clears throat> I will try to find where exactly those Muhammad and they called. Maybe here. For some reason, this video have no sound. I wish Muhammad at that time he have a camera so we can watch him live. I would be the no, not this one. Hold on. <clears throat> The description of paradise 18 plus 18 yeah well this one i see it but it doesn't say that it doesn't have that i don't know maybe maybe in the video in the long video let us see in the long run oh, here we go hold on i think i found it but where is that in which point of the video i think here let us see no. I'm very good. So what do you think about the Quran speaking that you can have sex with your daughter in the interpretation if she is daughter from adultery? <coughs> Where is the, the hadith? You are the person who speaks Arabic. You are perfect. It's in front of you. This is the chapter of 25, verse number 54. And this is Tafsir al-Qurtubi, as you see in the screen. Jami'u al-Ahkam al-Qur'an al-Qurtubi. 
And read with me, here we go. Read it. Now this guy is a Moroccan, he speaks Arabic. And he's calling to defend Islam. And those liars, they say, Chris CP is lying, CP. Is lying. Islam is the religion teaching that you can have sex with your daughter if she's the daughter from adultery, not from marriage. You speak Arabic, you are Moroccan, you are Moroccan, okay. <coughs> He's reading now. The astonishing teaching of Allah. <coughs> what he will say? You have nothing to say. Silence. All to read this is just four lines. But this is not a hadith. This is just a... interpretation. Interpretation. Okay, it says you can have sex with your daughter if she is daughter from adultery. Why? Why you must believe in that? Mute. You have nothing to say. Cowards. Look. Read it, brother. Read. Read in Arabic. Read. Let us hear your your Arabic reading. I want to. I, I like. Now, if you go to Mimi Hijabi, we say, liar, it doesn't say that. It doesn't say that. I like, I like Moroccan when they read Arabic. Go ahead. Praise be to Allah. We have an amazing book teaching us that if I have a daughter, she is not my, the daughter of my wife, but she is my daughter, I can have sex with her too. That's amazing, brother. This is his interpretation. It's true, but this is the interpretation. This is your scholar, Al Qurtubi, and, and this is not me. This is not a Christian scholar. You, why Al Qurtubi saying that, my friend? Why Al Qurtubi saying that? Why Al Qurtubi saying that? He mistaken. Okay. He's, he's not a prophet. He can be, he can do any mistake. Hmm. He's not a prophet. Yes. But the Quran says, okay. Let me ask you. According to the scholars of Islam, is your daughter from adultery yes. is considered as your daughter? I don't know about this. Uh, I don't tell me you do not know. Suddenly he do not know. The guy is calling me liar. The, the guy he is calling me to refute me. The guy he know his religion. Suddenly he do not know.